Hey guys, it's Jay Cini here. Thank you for joining me and today we are going for a walk. I see the storm clouds coming, filling up the sky. Today we are going for a walk. I do not know where we are going to go, but hopefully we can get some awesome footage and have a great day doing it. So here we go. A cheaper bottle of wine. All this weather's making it hard to drive you off my mind. And I know it won't go on forever. The sun will shine again right now. So we just walked all the way down that hill. It's pretty far. It's been a very long time since I've come down here. You can hear the cicadas are really, really loud. Every now and then I'll get a question come through where people are like, Jay, how do you do so much stuff? You know, like you're always so busy. Like, how do you have time for all these things? And I guess the answer I have for that is you just have to keep yourself really busy. You need to not waste your time on things that aren't gonna gain you anything and spend lots and lots of time on the things that you really enjoy and are gonna get you further in what you wanna do. I used to waste a lot of time playing video games and just doing stuff that generally wasn't that helpful uh, to my career, you know. I did a lot, of, a lot of good stuff, like I spent a lot of time practicing guitar and uh, just getting better and keeping fit and all that sort of thing. But there's so much more that you can do with your time. You have no idea how much you're probably wasting. Even now, I still do waste a lot of time. I just use my time a bit more efficiently. Pretty much all I do is just spend my time on stuff that I know is going to improve my career or help me to make more money or learn new things. It's a very fast-paced world that we live in. Things are always changing. Stuff's always happening. So it's really important that you're prepared for that sort of thing as well. Like uh, the last probably six months, I've spent a lot of time developing multiple streams of income. So if something goes down and you know I can't do that job anymore, there's something I can do. I have It's not just that thing that I'm relying on. So I think at the moment I'm up to about five or six different streams of income because nowadays it's so important to have multiple streams. So the first one I've got is obviously playing music and getting out there and playing gigs, which I love. It's where I know most of you guys from. Then on top of that, there's merch uh, and selling all our merch. I also do a bit of teaching privately for guitar and I also teach in high schools and primary schools. So I have a couple of streams there. And uh, on top of that, I've started to do music videos for people, which is another stream of income. So something I learned pretty early on is that knowledge is power. The more you know, the more you can control your life and what happens. I mean, imagine if you could see a week into the future, how much you'd be out of control. Now, obviously, people can't see into the future, but knowing lots of different things, it makes it easier to predict the future. So that's why I spend most of my time just reading and learning new things about the world. It's a very, very interesting place, and I can guarantee that you'll never run out of things to read now that we have the internet. So I guess to the real point of this video, what should you do on your days off? You can pretty much do anything, but I think the most important thing is don't waste your time. Uh, we're very limited for time here on Earth. It might feel like it goes forever when you're at work, but I guarantee that it's gonna be amazing. You'll be 60 years old and wonder where all the time went. Like, I can't believe that I'm 26 now. It only feels like yesterday I was a kid doing kid stuff. <laughs> Just spend your time learning new things, uh, being, being involved in things that you love, connecting with people that you love, all that sort of thing. Just don't waste your time. So many people I talk to always say, oh man, I wish I learned how to do this. I wish I learned how to do that. I wish I learned how to play guitar. Well, what's stopping you? Maybe it's nothing to do with music. Maybe it's something else. Maybe you always wanted to learn how to take good photos. That's a perfectly, perfectly awesome thing to be looking at doing. So 
instead of turning on Netflix or, or anything like that, playing the Xbox, just spend a little bit of time learning how to do what you really want to do and I guarantee that skill will stay with you for life. A lot of people say that it takes 22 days to make or break a habit and I, I think that's about the right number. So if you can stick to something like guitar or, or drums or taking photos for 22 days, I guarantee that you'll continue to do it for quite a long time. Uh, it was the same thing for me and getting into the gym. At first I found it really hard, because it was really hard. Uh, it's never easy going to the gym and lifting a lot of weight and doing it properly. But you stick at it for probably three weeks, three or four weeks, I guarantee that you'll just keep going back and you'll have a great time doing it. Because uh, you need to develop that habit in your head. That will take time. But once you do it, it stays there. So that about wraps it up. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's been really fun to have a chat to you guys about life and all that sort of thing in general. So we have lots of new music coming next year, more gigs, it's gonna be very exciting. So stay tuned to the channel, make sure you like the video and subscribe, and we'll see you later.